Hi guys, I hope you're all doing great. So this video is all about making miniatures. So I recently discovered this thing called Fevicryl Molded. I saw a lot of stuff on Instagram and I tried my hands on a few of it. So let's see how to make them. So let's get into the video. So this is what it is. It is Fevicryl Molded and it is pretty cheap. It's like really cheap actually. You get 800 grams for like 250 rupees and it comes with a sturdy packaging. You can just open it and there is a small box inside. I mean, sorry, the box that is of the same size of the package. So when you slide the box out, you find two components. So one is black in color. I mean, I mean, sorry, one is gray in color. The other one is white. This is basically like white MC that you get in hardware stores. And you need to mix them both together to form the clay-like consistency so that you can mold it just the way you want. Seriously, you can play around with your creativity. This one, I found it on Amazon. So let's mix these both together. Apply talcum powder so that it doesn't stick to your hands. I mean, wash your hands thoroughly even after you use this. Okay, like do not eat this inside. It is poisonous of course it is definitely definitely not edible guys so please wash your hands really well so sprinkle talcum powder and start knitting them together yeah so yeah it's a, such a task so once it is done i'm going to make a small alien like creature so i'm making a big uh spear like thing okay a ball So I'm making two small balls and they'll be the eyes for the miniature toy I'm making here. Okay, so yeah, so I'm going to make two of them. And then I'm going to take some more of molded clay and make a slightly longer thing. Okay, like make two of it and these will be the hands for the alien. Yeah. Okay, let's call it alien. I think that's easier than this. Yes. So I'm going to make one more. I'm going to follow the same steps again. So yeah, so this is how it looks. And make sure you just stick it together. Like it should be greasy. This just dries off very quickly. So you need to make it really fast. You just have to, yeah, just so that it sticks with each other. The pieces should stick, stick with each other. Oh my god, what am I blabbering? Okay, so I'm going to make some more and these are going to be slightly longer, I mean sorry, shorter and these will act like legs for the creature, okay, I mean miniature. So yeah, so this is how it looks, I mean it looks quite unfinished. So let's keep this for drying out, I mean if this is going to be really big this has a ball like thing right so it takes quite a longer time for it to dry so after it has dried thoroughly i let it dry for at least half a day okay? and one more thing took at least a four full day to get dried off and yeah it is worth it so here i'm going to use acrylic colors to paint this i'm going to use the red color so i'm going to paint the entire body in red color just leave the eyes and paint the rest of it you'll see how it is going to come out we paint it completely. So I'm gonna paint the entire thing and make sure I'm gonna keep it here because it's such a task holding it. I don't want the paint to come off. So I'm gonna be a little careful there near the eyes because I'm gonna make them white. So I'm going to paint the entire thing red. Okay, just suggest me a name for this guy. Yeah. I mean, I'm going to place this guy with his new friends. I'm going to keep this on the molded pack itself so that the base doesn't stick with the study table here. I don't want to ruin it, of course. So it is almost done. So after the red color thing dried, I'm going to use the white color acrylic paint. I'm going to shut this off. Yeah, so I'm going to open this one and use the white color acrylic paint. 
even the base is white but then applying white color over this will give a better finish so be careful with this use a thin brush for this process yeah so use the entire surface just do the white color yeah so this is done i'm going to practice some stroke and i'm going to give a smiley face yeah i mean i want my toys to be smiling all the time guys seriously <laughs> so this be careful when you do this i mean even if it is not coming okay just leave it it's okay just paint them red again and do it again so this is done and the eyes are also dry so i'm going to give the black color dot for the eyeball a small circle would do so it's complete it's almost complete my new friend is ready for the study table you can use it to keep it on your dining table your counter top and everywhere else so yeah this is done say hi to your new friend so i made some more this is a penguin that i made the other day i mean this was a task guys seriously and the other one there is another alien in yellow color and there i got a pink elephant a miniature elephant and these three guys are friends yeah so i also made a home out of it i mean this looks cute i find it cute and this is the first ever thing i made to practice so so that i can show you guys this is a milk maid bottle i painted with chalk paints and added this small pendant like this so that's it for today's video and you can let your creativity flow guys seriously you can do anything out of this and this is such a versatile thing so like share and subscribe to my channel and take care bye bye